Hello and welcome back to another Yakuza Kiwami 2 bonus episode. This time we are attacking Yua's side story stuff so that way I can grind up at least one of the girls for the final match that was that you've already seen. But I haven't seen it yet, so hopefully it was good. Anyways, let's just get straight into it today. Ah, it's you, Kiryu-san. Good to see you. Do you want to grab a bite with me? Hmm, should I go, uh, go eat with you? Sure, sounds good. Yay, let's go. Can't remember, have I customized you yet? I'll find out here in a second. I think I did. Yes, I did. I did. I remember now. Very much so. Now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure this is the first time we're really getting to sit down and talk face to face. <laughs> I guess you're right. I can't wait to get started, Kiryu-san. And maybe, if we get close enough, you might just fall in love with me. <laughs> I don't know about that. Just go easy on me, okay? Do you have much of a life outside of work, Yua? I can't really imagine it. Really? But I'm a totally regular girl. Turn it down a little bit on my end. Okay then, what do you like to do on your days off? Mm, let me think. Honestly, I spent a lot of time watching Idol DVDs. I give you the Idol clothes. That's perfect. Yes, I love them. I thought you this, they were usually male-centric, though. Girls are into them, too? Of course we are. There's totally... There's actually been a huge bump in I, female Idol fans recently. Seeing those cute girls dance their hearts out on stage is a surf, surefire way to cheer me out. Cheer me up. I cannot read. Does that really work? You bet. I highly recommend it, Kiryu-san. Ah, oh, do you want to borrow one? Oh, don't start barking, guys, please. Let me calm them down. Time out. Oi.
you stop going down? Sorry about that, roommates got some food and uh, that always makes the dogs go nuts. Um, I'd love to, I'd also love this tea. Do you, do you really think it's that good? I'd love to. Wow, you mean it? Yeah, I want to learn more about you and this will be the perfect opportunity. Thanks, Kiryu-san. I'm so glad to hear you say that. Seriously. Yeah, and Kiryu watching idol videos is just funny. I'll put my heart into my work for you. I can't wait. Really though, I had no idea you were this into the idol scene. Well, I used to be one myself a lot. So it's only natural I'm into it. I put you in the idol clothes. Right, I've definitely heard about that. Just wasn't sure if it was true. Believe it. You know, I was actually pretty big. Wow, that's impressive. Though, if you were that popular, why'd you quit? Why do you think? Because you're better suited to cabaret? That's right, you're amazing, Kiryu-san. It sounds like you know everything about me. Wow, I was just guessing. You're you an expert. Rank 3. I don't know about that. Anyway, what got you started? Well, outside of the best in the business idols, I really didn't make much money. I was even having trouble supporting myself, so I got a hostess job and never looked back. Then, once I figured out I was good at it, I rocketed to the club's number one spot. I'd always dreamed of being an idol, but it was clear Cabaret was where I belonged. I guess that's why I quit. My skills were better utilized as a hostess. Right. And you are good at it. Not just anyone can do this job. As long as you're happy with your choice, nobody can tell you you're wrong. Y you tell you you're wrong. Mm -hmm. I totally know I made the right call. And I wouldn't have met you otherwise. Oh, stop. What a response. You really make a good hostess, Yua. I'm having trouble imagining, though, what's the life of an idol like? Really, it all boils down to singing and dancing, concerts, lessons, that kind of stuff. You sometimes do handshake events, too. There's a lot of fan interaction involved. Handshake events, huh? Your fans must have loved that. They were over the moon. Oh, and I did Graviera too. Yep, it's all about the cute bikinis. Though there were some sexy ones too. Oh my. Sexy bikinis. <laughs> Kitty san <laughs> uh, Oh, sorry. I was just thinking about the fan reaction. Fan reaction. Imagine us doing something like that, I bet our customers would be thrilled. You're totally right. How can we get Force Shine up to speed? A bikini festival. Um... Yeah, B a bikini festival is the only way. Huh? You mean like putting all the girls in bikinis? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. 
Well, actually, he sounds kind of fun. Just give me a cute bikini and I'm happy. <laughs> Although, I'd be okay with it for sure. But I bet some of the others wouldn't be thrilled. Hmm, that would be a problem. I might sway them with a good excuse, but they'll never agree if they realize you just want to see them in bikinis. Th that has nothing to do with me. This would be for the customers. He's thinking of the customers. Uh-huh. Good luck convincing them of that. Hmm. You know, idols really put themselves out there now. Not like back in my day. Back in your near day, huh? What were they like? For one, there weren't many large groups. Everyone was mostly solo. Besides that, there was a lot more. It was a lot more difficult to meet one in person. Wow, I had no idea. Were you crushing on any of them, Kiryu-san? There was this one I liked. Yeah, though I can't remember of any. Wow, really? Who was it? Who was it? Just some idol who was popular at the time. I wasn't cra too crazy for her, though. I just can't think of... What idol that would have been from Zero. Wow, I didn't know guys like you had those kinds of phases. Just goes to show you, you really are human. What's that supposed to mean? Hold on, how exactly do you see me? Perfect. Oh yeah, it means my interaction for that one. Always forget about that. Well, we've been here a while now. We should probably take off. Agreed. Today was really fun, Kiryu-san. I'm so glad we got the chance to talk. Let's do this again sometime. Sounds good. See you later, Yua. I can't wait. Give me those sweet, sweet levels. Alrighty, we're back here, so you know what that means. I'll see you in a moment. Alrighty, we're back in for the second part. It's you, Kiryu-san. Are you busy? Hmm? Why do you ask? I wanna grab a bite with you again. Hmm, another invitation. What should I say? Ah, oh, yeah, that's why we're here, Kiryu. Sure, sounds good. Let's eat. Yay, yay, yay! Well, let's get a little more comfortable in this. See? Uh. You've been with Forshine for a while now, Yua. How are you finding it? Oh, it's great. I'm having so much fun. And customers are starting to ask for me specifically now, too. It's a great feeling. Glad to hear it. Let's hope you can keep up, keep the momentum rolling. Agreed. Now I'm ready to eat. Kiryu-san, are Sakans, um, do you think they're more aggressive? Hmm? Why do you ask? People are a lot more forward than at my old club. The other day someone gave me a present for no reason. Oh, that doesn't seem so unusual. But, well, that present, it was a brand new car. Whoa, a car. Yeah, I didn't know how to respond. <laughs> Let's sell it. Getting a car from someone doesn't happen every day. The guy must really adore you, Yua. I guess so. Oh, and of course you turned the car. I mean, I was happy, but I felt bad too. I already knew he liked me before the gift. You should have told him that. 
It's like how you love hearing their thoughts. Your customers will be thrilled to hear yours too. Yeah. Kiryu-san. That's such a good point. I'll try to be more open from now on. Mm-hmm. Good. That really make people happy. You know, it seems like you're pretty popular. You must have a lot of fans. Anyone you're interested in? Mm hmm? Mm hmm. They're good people for sure. But none I'd consider romantic interest. Um, maybe my standards are too high? What's your type then? Mm, they'd have to be... Super cool, super nice, and super strong. Super rich. A prince riding on a uh, white horse. That's me minus the horse. Your prince is right in front of you. No, that's way dead now. You'll find your prince someday. What a list. You'll find your prince someday, Yua. You think so? You're that certain, Kiryu-san. I'm sure it'll happen. Though honestly, I already found someone who pretty much fits the bill. Is it me? I had no idea. Well, he doesn't exactly ride a white horse, but he's perfect in almost every other way. In that case, you should keep an eye out. See if he gets any gets near any horses. I can do that. I wonder if he'll ride one soon. I hope so. Your popularity really is through the roof, though. That says a lot about your skills as a hostess. Well, I definitely have a lot of faithful fans, but I'm not so sure about the skills part. Why do you say that? Honestly, I make a lot of careless mistakes. I'm clumsy, so I mess things up a lot. The worst part is, sometimes I can't even remember how to pronounce my customers' names. Really? Really, I thought Kiryu was pronounced Kiranama for a while. So I used to call it Atenbori instead of Sotenbori. You are. You're kinda dumb, huh? It's part of your appeal. That clumsiness is a big part of your appeal. A lot of guys are into girls like that. Kiryu-san, thank you. But even so, some guys might think I'm being rude. So I should try to improve it if I can. If it worries you that much, it may not hurt to study up. I can help. Good guy, Kiryu. You will? I can't wait to have you as my tutor. Hmm? Question mark? I just realized. I can't read this kanji. Oh, you are. Which one is it? I'll teach you. Do I have to try to answer? Thanks you so much. It's this one. I don't know kanji. Uh, th this one, huh? Yeah, fish names can be so darn tough. I just can't keep them straight. It's... Uh, well, at least it didn't flash in. It's giving me a multiple choice answer. Um, it's, uh, sorry, I'm not sure. Huh? Even you don't know Kiryu Sam? Yeah, fish names can be brutally tough sometimes. I've never been able to read them. 
Oh, I'm so... Oh, I'm glad. If you can't remember them, then I... I don't need to either. Don't rub it in. Come on, we can be forgetful together. I guess that's one way to look at it. Yeah. Normal. Not bad, not bad. Could have been better. Could have been worse. Well, we've been here for a while, we should probably take off. Agreed. Thanks, thanks Kiryu-san, that was fun. Let's do this, let's do this again sometime, yeah? Sounds good. See you later, Yua. Bye-bye! Alrighty. I'll see you in part three. Okay, time to move on to part three. Why do you need something? Just some time with my charming manager. Let's go somewhere. Should I accept you as, uh, yes. Sure, sounds good. Let's go somewhere we can talk. Yay. To the bar. Cause that's where all the big talks happen. Would you stop falling? I'm so happy you came. I was really hoping we could talk today, Kiryu son. Oh yeah? Is there something specific you want to ask me? Not just one thing. I have tons of questions. You better be ready. Eh, alright. Ask away. So excited. Kiryu-san, can I ask you about something? Of course, what's on your mind? Well, um, it feels like someone's been watching me. I mean, punch him. What? Like a stalker? That's what I thought at first, but turns out it's the paparazzi. Paparazzi? You mean those guys who take pictures of celebrities' private lives? Yeah. I wonder if they're gonna write an article about me being a hostess now. Right. Guess I wouldn't be surprised. What with your idol history, or your history as an idol. Hmm. I honestly don't mind being in an article, but I just wish they'd ask my permission. I'll protect you. I'll protect you from them, Yua. Huh? You will. That's right. They're using you without your permission. And it's my job to put a stop to that. I may punch him. Right in the schnoz. Beyond that, there are some dangerous people out there. I can't bear to see anything happen to you. Kiryu-san, thank you so much. I'm honestly kind of scared. But if you're with me, I'll be okay. I was worried there was like, why isn't it triggering anything? If the paparazzi are coming for you though, you must have been a pretty famous idol. That's not true at all, not one bit. Though I did have a small following. What about your old fans? Have they dropped by the club at all? Mm -hmm. The ones who were most supported back then are the, some of my best customers now. I'm especially thankful for those who have been cheering me on since before I was even popular. That's so... That's so like you, Yua. You clearly treasure your fans. Just like when you were still an idol. You think so? An idol is supposed to make her fans happy, so that was always my top priority. Every day, I was in it for them. If I can keep that mindset alive as a hostess, that's all I need. You're doing great as is. Just keep it up, okay? I will, of course. Oh, that was a low one. So you were an idol and now you're a hostess. Do you have any big dreams for what comes next? 
Dreams? This might seem kind of sappy, but I'd like to be a bride someday. Oh, so you're planning to get married? Of course I am. When my prince comes in on his white horse, I'll marry him. I'll be really devoted to my man, too. I'd do anything my hubby asked him to. Anything? Oh, I'm just asking this for a reference. But if I, you and I get married, Kiryu-san, what would you want me to do for you? Oh my. I don't want you to do anything. Huh? Are you sure? All I need is to have that smiling face by my side. If that was the only thing my wife did, I'd be happy. Kill you, son. That's that's so romantic. I definitely want to marry you now, Kiryu san I'm honored. Stop it. I can stand behind you, uh, beside you, and smile, which means you can do all the cleaning and laundry. Huh? Uh, hold on. Let me rethink this. By the way, I'm really glad you decided to join us, Yua. I really am. I'm glad I decided to come to Forshine, too. You are? Mm -hmm. I love it here. Wow. What exactly do you love about it? You're the manager, why don't you guess? Alright, it must be... That we're a family. Our lack of quotas, our attitude to... Our friendly, our friendly atmosphere. Our friendly atmosphere. That definitely plays a part. Everyone's so nice and have fun to be with. If that's just a part, that means there's something else. Mm -hmm. Best thing is, is your attitude towards customers. You mean how open we are? Mm -hmm. My last club was really fancy, so they only ever let re rich customers in. And all my friends from my idol days weren't allowed inside. That's too bad. But Forshine doesn't stop any potential customers from coming in. It's really a perfect fit for me. That's a Yua answer, through and through. I might not be an idol anymore, but I want to treat all my customers with care and respect. Idols give their fans hope. And I'm going to do that for my customers here. I'll be a cabaret idol. I think you already are. I mean, you're in the idol outfit. By accident, still, I... I was just trying to maximize, like, okay, wh wh where do I need, like, S tiers at, and I landed on that. I guess it's about time. We should probably get going. Agreed. Today was a lots of fun carries on. I'm so glad we got a chance to talk. Me too, Yua. You really brightened my day. Anyway, I'll see you around. Right. Bye bye. Oh, one more night, and you'll be at 40. Excellent. So, uh, I'm gonna go take care of that real quick, and then we can get to, uh, the, uh, words sub story. Alrighty. It's time for the sub, sub story. Uh. Hi, Kiryu san. Do you have some time today? Why, what's wrong? Well, you know the paparazzi I was telling you about before? Things have gotten a little worse lately. 
I was hoping we could talk about it, just the two of us. Right. This won't be easy. Should I lend her an ear? Uh, yes. Sure. Let's go somewhere we can talk. Thanks so much, Kirigi-san. Alright, Iwa. Tell me what's going on. Well, you know how I told you that paparazzi was following me? Things have really... escalated in the past couple days. Big scoop, you are in love. Escalated? How so? Feels like I can't get away from him. Even when I'm home alone, I get the feeling someone's watching me. Do you know how scary that is? Feeling like you never have a second to yourself? I could only imagine. Either way, this has gone too far. I'm not convinced it's the paparazzi anymore. You might be in serious danger, Yua. Danger? I'm already afraid enough as is, Kiryu-san. You don't need to scare me even more. How's this gonna turn out? Hmm. What did the stalker do? Let's say I'm the stalker. I do it because I like watching you, I guess. What? That's so creepy. Why would anyone do stuff like that? These people can be delusional sometimes. They get close, then confuse that physical closeness for emotional connection. They start to think, I want to make you happy forever and ever. And then the only way to do that is to get closer. What do you even say to someone like that? I don't know what to do, Kiryu-san. I'm so scared. Don't worry, Yua. I'll be here to protect you, no matter what happens. Kiryu-san. Someone's clearly after you, though. Do you want me to walk you home? Oh, that would make me feel so much safer. Thank you, Kiryu-san. Alright then. Let's get you home. <laughs> I'm so glad I decided to talk to you, Kiryu-san. I'm just glad to see you smiling again. Where's your place, Yua? Just this way. Let's go. Ah! What the? <laughs> this is gonna be such a huge scoop. What's the headline? Maybe na the National Hostess's Forbidden Love? Kiryu san, that's him. That's the stalker. Come on, Yua. Let's put an end to this. Hey, you. What are you mumbling about forbidden love? I was just out to lunch with my manager. <laughs> like I care. Once I push this to the presses, nobody's gonna believe a word you say. But there's nothing strange about a hostess spending time with her manager. Nobody will trust that scoop of yours with just a few photos. Good thing I got more than a few photos then. I have proof. Proof? Truth is, I snuck a recording device into your cute little hostess's jacket. Got a record of your entire conversation. Huh? You know that's illegal, right? Besides, neither of us had anything you could use as proof. In that case, why don't you take a listen? I like watching you. I want to make you happy forever and ever. Alright, then. Let's get you home. This is some touching shit, buddy. A real suave confession. I wonder what the public would think if they got a hold of this. Wait, but... Oh, I got one more, too. Don't worry, Yua. I'll be here to protect you, no matter what happens. That's... Such a strong, supportive manager. Too bad though this will be the end of the line for your club. Once this news drops, you and Forshine are both going down the shitter. Forshine? Why are you doing this? Eh, because I'm getting paid. Handsomely. And another manager is giving me two mil to drag your club through the mud. What? Just think about it. Forshine's business has been booming lately. Don't you think that'll make some other clubs a teensy bit jealous? This is horrible. What should we do, Kiryu-san? I already told you, Yua. You don't need to worry. I'm here to protect you and Forshine, no matter what. Kiryu-san. Look, I don't know who you are, but I suggest you just walk away. You've put Yua through enough. Leave your camera, your phone, and get out of here before this gets ugly. I might even forgive you. And why the hell would I do that? 
You thick in the head, buddy? Hmm. Don't say I didn't warn you. So this is what's coming to you, uh huh? I'll give you the beat down of a lifetime, asshole. Are you sure about that? That as the finisher. Oh. Camera. Phone. Now. Why should I? You want some more? Fine. Here. Are you okay here, you son? Hmm? I'm fine. He is a pushover. I'm... I'm so sorry. I dragged you into such a mess, Kiryu-san. Don't blame yourself, Yua. I'm sure this wasn't- it wasn't easy having a guy watching your every move. It wasn't, but I'm not scared anymore. I mean, you'll be here to protect me, right, Kiryu-san? Yeah, I guess so. Thank you again for helping me today, Kiryu-san. I think I can finally breathe easy now. Yeah, I don't think that guy will be coming back to take pictures anytime soon. Speaking of, um, Kiryu-san, can I ask you something? Hmm? What's up? Do you think you could give me the camera film that in that guy's phone? I mean, who knows what kind of photos he ended up taking of me. Sure, if you want. I was gonna get rid of them myself, but you're right, it's safer with you. Thank you, Kiryu-san. I suppose that means you don't trust me with them, huh? Hehehe, <laughs> maybe not. But you do give the other hostesses some pervy glances sometimes. What are you talking about? I'm looking at them as any manager would. Hehehe, <laughs> someone's flustered. I'll treasure this recording forever. Don't worry, Yua. I'll be here to protect you, no matter what happens. And that covers the final one. Uh, next, because I'm sure we'll get Kirara as a... Uh, I'm just going to pause that before it starts typing. I have a lot of money. Anyways, I'm sure we're going to have a Kirara episode and a Yuki episode. But that will be after I finish the next part of the... Uh, which we call it um cabaret club and that's if i get kirara we already i already know i have yuki and i'm sure i just gotta wait to pass that we'll go from there i don't know you've already seen you know the story i know nothing at this moment i'm not even sure what the episode after that's gonna be we'll find out when we get there until then until next time.